Well, two convenience store clerks are sharing their story tonight about a man who brought in a baby saying that he could no longer take care of it. Thanks for joining us. I'm Renee McCullough. And I'm Matt Templeman. An amazing story. KZI 9 News reporter Shanu Her is live in the newsroom with more on this story that you'll only see on KZI 9 News. Chinu. Matt and Renee, the incident happened on Sunday night at the Dairy Mart on Barger Drive in Eugene. Now, man management says the two employees did the right thing by helping the man and baby in need. It was a typical Sunday night shift. We were getting ready to close, doing paperwork, um, sweeping, mopping, stuff like that. Until these two Dairy Mart employees say something unusual startled them. Man came to the door with the baby asked us to call 911 and DHS and we were kind of hesitant at first because of the whole, you know, in case of being robbed and stuff. Jennifer Nix and Cindy Yuka looked at the man's face, then noticed what he was carrying. That's when they knew they had to act fast. It's cold outside. This man has a baby and he's crying. Something was wrong. Something was definitely wrong. He needed help. Nix and Yuka say they asked the man questions before handing him the phone to call 911. We asked him some questions like, is he the father? Where's the mom? Is the baby his? <laughs> um, he said that the mother was not willing to take care of the baby at this time and he didn't have any means of taking care of the baby. He wasn't sure if he was the father or not. Um, we held the baby in the store. He called 911. After the phone call, he wrote down the baby's full name, uh, his name, his telephone number, um, and then he said he wanted to wait outside. Both say the man then sat outside and waited until authorities arrived and he cooperated. While waiting, Yuga says she checked the baby for any visible harm, but he seemed healthy and slept the whole time. Nix and Yuka say Dairy Mart is a safe place and they are glad they were there to help. I think anybody would have done that. It's the right thing to do. Eugene police say they responded to the initial call a little after 11 p.m. on Sunday and have since turned the investigation over to the Department of Human Services. It's unclear what will happen to the man who surrendered the baby, if anything. Live in the newsroom, Chinuhur, KZI 9 News.